In the next hour, a face covering order is going to go into effect for all of Tarrant County. That does include Fort Worth. Businesses actually have until next week technically to comply with this. But as Jason Allen found out today, many were already telling customers to go ahead and cover up today. The signs send a message that face masks should be something North Texans are already familiar with. That if you can wear a hat, you can wear a mask. And if that's not convincing, some just simply spelled out it was now a government order. As soon as he put that out, we had that up. Leaves Tea and Bookshop actually had its mask sign up yesterday after the county judge announced the order. By Friday, stores all over Fort Worth had joined them. That was despite technically having until next Wednesday to officially post a health and safety policy requiring face coverings inside businesses. It was just kind of an extra layer of insulation, I guess, from people being upset at having to wear the mask. Then you can kind of, the responsibility is off of us, and we can say, well, it's just now, it's just mandated. So there's now, there's no wiggle room for or argument. It's just policy across the board. So. Morgan Mercantile has had a few uncomfortable interactions with customers since it reopened three weeks ago and required masks. That's why the business and several others we talked to are re emphasizing online and curbside options for shopping while complying with the new order inside the store. We felt like it was one of the easiest kind of no brainers to, to keep ourselves and other people safe. We did see a business today that had a sign up telling customers masks were required, but none of the employees inside the store were wearing one. The county order does allow for that. However, businesses are supposed to clearly spell out the reasons for it in their posted policy. In Fort Worth, Jason Allen, CBS 11 News.